Hey guys, it's me, So-So. I might be a little quieter today because I'm literally recording this audio at 1 in the morning because I've messed up my sleep schedule from procrastination and I can't fall asleep now, so I figured might as well be productive and record the audio. Yay! Okay, so this character here, she is, uh... Another OC of mine, she's actually from a whole other story from the uh, XD meme. Those are from my, I, I don't really have a title for it. I call it Dead and Immortal. It's a bit of an intense title. I'm thinking about changing it, but I don't know to what. Um, so this angel girl here, she is from the story, uh, Dear Angel Love Demon. I don't know, I, I kind of came up with the name and then came up with a story to go with it. But now I'm debating on the name as well, because I changed the plot a bit. Anyway, so this is Medisol. So her story is still under development, it's not as well thought out as the other one. So what's happening here is, so we have angels and demons, and instead of going with heaven, and stuff I decided to go with underworld and overworld because this isn't really a religious sort of story and I don't want people to confuse it with that so it's gonna be underworld and overworld kind of debating overworld but you know um, so she is an angel uh, she has a younger sister her name's Angelica and Angelica is the cutest so one day she finds out that Angelica has been sneaking a demon boy into the overworld and they meet like every Saturday or something and uh yeah and she claims that they were deeply in love and Angelica really really wanted to make him an angel that way they could be together and uh of course Marisol is like uh I'm not really sure about that um which is understandable oh one of the distinguishable features from angels and demons is that uh angels they have like really pale hair i they have different skin tones of course but like their hair color is like pastel so like instead of black hairs some will probably have like light brown or maybe like a bluish you know, like marinettes, but like toned down the lightness. I forgot the word for it. Oh my gosh. Um, contrast? Yeah. And then, uh, demons, they have really dark hairs. I don't know why I made this distinction. And then we have Marisol. Originally, her hair was white like her sister's. Um, so yeah. They, she finds out. And then Marisol's like, okay, I'll help you. And then... One day, the scrolls... The ancient scrolls of blah blah blah, still haven't thought of a name. I know, great story. Um, they have been stolen. And these scrolls are what distinguishes an angel from a demon. It says, this is what makes an angel, this is what makes a demon. If you can't do this, then... Yeah. You can't be an angel, or you can't be a demon. So, if these scrolls are gone, and they are the thing, and they are what's protecting the borders to keep the two worlds from mixing, otherwise it'd be complete chaos on the earth, because they are the ones who take care of humans, uh, it'd just be utter- it'd be a horror show for, you know, innocent human beings like me. So, yeah. Without these scrolls, what's to say that a demon can't be an angel, or an angel can't be a demon? Uh, so, of course, God finds out. Uh, unlike, you know, in Christianity where God is all-knowing and all of that, this time he's in this, he's more like a leader figure. He's not all-knowing, but he is all-powerful. You know, like the genie from Aladdin. And he finds out that uh he figures out that the demon boy has been snuck in 
and he was actually figuring out the layout of the entire palace and he stole the scrolls. Of course, they successfully recover the scrolls, but he doesn't. But God doesn't know who did it. So Marisol takes the blame for her sister because uh, her sister was the most important thing to her. It was worth more than anything in her life. Oh, oh my gosh, she was worth more than anything in her life. So Marisol gets cast down to the underworld. So I imagine that the overworld um, I guess it's like heaven, but it's more of a Greek, Roman, it's a Greco-Roman style, uh, a lot of beautiful marble architecture, a lot of columns, but it's also really old-fashioned, like really ancient, because it came before, and they decided to just never upgrade it, because, you know, why not? Um, and it's just beautiful, and the colors are so pastel and white and blinding for some and it's a very beautiful place anyway um and in the underworld that is it's a uh, lava because it is under like near the earth's core so it's lava and it's really hot there so yeah and everyone has dark hair most of them are tan because, you know, lava and the whole heat thing. I mean, yeah. And there's a lot of stuff going on. And so, Marisol, uh, to try and hide her, because she's cast down and she's turned into a demon. Because when you sin, you are considered, you are no longer considered an angel. So, she, um, decided to dye her hair. And her eye color did end up changing. And it's kind of hard to see in the drawing. But it they are black with red pupils. And I don't know, I just thought those were really cool. And a little cliche, but you know, it doesn't really matter. Anyway, so she's cast down. And she dyes her hair dark. Like dark pink or something. But you know how I said angels, their hair... Oh, is always pastel or like really light so her hair because she never did anything wrong I mean technically she lied but it was to save someone her hair goes back to that sort of bright pink it's because it's like a middle ground for what she did Angelica's hair on the other hand is fading slightly ignore that it's getting slightly darker so yeah, that's all I've got so far. Any suggestions? Please leave in the comments because I'm very curious to see where this one goes. Oh yeah, before I forget, uh, this piece is actually a redraw of the first time I drew Medisol. Um, her character design was completely random. Like I had the story, I, I mean, not really story, but you know, I had the title. And I just kind of drew her one day. I was like, this is going to be Medisol. That's what she's going to look like. So yeah, this is a redraw. Let's just get a nice before and after. Mmm, that's the good stuff. That's all, guys. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more upcoming videos. I also have Instagram and TikTok. Links in the description. Thanks for watching. Bye!